Welcome back to Roofing 101. My name is Ben Matthews and today we're going to be talking about skylights. Uh, primarily, Velux skylights. There's a couple different manufacturers of skylights out there. I've personally installed them all. None of them are, are bad. I just find that Velux as a company and as a product really stands above the rest. They're the largest skylight manufacturer on the planet. Uh, it's what they do and they do it very well. Uh, I've never really had issues, but if anything has arose personally, I've just found them to be extremely responsive. Um, taking care of their customers and making sure that it's a good experience from a contractor side, a customer side, and a product that's going to last for a long time to come. That being said, they also have a lot of really good options. Um, historically, window companies kind of got into skylights figuring, hey, a skylight's like a window but for a roof. That was absolutely not the case. Whenever we meet with customers that got skylights 10, 15 years ago, they want nothing to do with them. They're trying to get them removed shingle over the roof. I'm happy to say that those issues have all been resolved and you really can get a lot of natural light and uh, air with a venting skylight into a home to, to really change the, uh, the feel of a home or, or the, uh, the atmosphere, if you will. They make sun tunnels, which are, are pretty easy to install. They make skylights for shingled roof, flat roofs, venting, non-venting, solar, with blinds, without blinds. The list goes on. We have a lot of great videos getting into the different variations of the skylights, the pros and the cons of each. Um, but also kind of price points, like what you should expect to pay for a skylight. Um, you know, it's a question we get, well, how much is it going to cost to, uh, to install one from new? Can I install one from new? Um, how much just to replace it, the flashings, things like that. So we have a couple different videos. We'll post links to those, getting into the, uh, what you should expect to cost, what you should expect it to cost, um, and everything like that. But like always, please feel free to leave a comment on this video. I'll be sure to get back to you to answer your questions. And uh, I really appreciate you watching, and uh, see you next time.